everyone, it's Jen here and a very warm welcome to my channel. I hope everybody's doing really well today um, and uh, hopefully you'll enjoy this little unbagging that I've got here for you. Um, now this is has been sent to me by um, the very nice people over at New Craft Day. Um, some uh, not diamond paintings, but diamond painting related. So for once, I've not got diamond paintings. Um, yeah, so this was sent for me to review. I was contacted by them and they asked me if I wanted to review a couple of products. And I said, yeah, that'd be lovely. Um, I have I've worked with them in the past. They're, um, they're a really good website. You know, they've got lots going on. Um, at the moment, they have, I think, spend $50 and get two free gifts. So yeah, it's worth checking out. I also have a discount code for them um, if you use my code GAMER10, that's capital G and the rest is lowercase and 10, all one word. I'll pop it across the screen. Anyway, uh, so if you use that code, you'll get 10% off your order as well. So I'm going to try and ignore Kenny who's scratching at the door. So yes, um, not diamond painting, but diamond painting related. And one of the things is something that I've actually been looking for to try for a little while. So let us see. So we have this. Claire, you might be interested in this. <laughs> um, um, oops. Oh, we have a pen and uh, oh, we have uh, something in a big white box. So, um, okay, well, why don't we look at the pen first? Now, I don't think I actually said what kind of pen that I wanted and I just said like, you know, they, they, they sent me the link to the pens and uh, and actually this this was a pen that I actually quite liked. <laughs> um, so yeah, so this is the pen I've sent. So it is a, called a flower pattern diamond painting pen and it's blue and gold in the resin there this is nice this is nice but they've got lots and lots of different styles i think there's two four the six different styles and there's a selection of um tips to go with it so we have our single placer it's quite snug there we go that's it in we have um a straightener I have a two placer, three placer. It's a wee bit rough there. We need to get a wee pair of scissors and snip that off. We have a four placer. We have looks like perhaps a seven or eight placer. Yep. And we have the little angled tip. I've never tried the angled one before. I must. I need to give it a wee go actually. Unfortunately, I don't really have anything cutted up here suitable to um, to try it out with. Let's put the straightener on this end. There we go. That fits in really nice. It's reasonably um, chunky. It's just a nice size for me. This is the kind of size of chunkiness that I like. I don't like really like it much bigger than this. But yeah, it's a lovely pen. What do you think? I like the blue and the gold. And it's kind of like, um, got the stems. It's kind of like foliage rather than floral. But yeah, I thought this looked, I thought this looked really cute. And I'm actually, I'm, I'm, uh, it's really cool that they've sent the one that I like the most <laughs> out, out of the selection. This was, this would have been the one that I would have chosen because I've never really seen one like this before. But yeah, this is uh, the pen. Now this costs, uh, what I'll do is I'll give the costs, the prices in pounds. Um, you can use the little drop down menu on their website to um, to get it in dollars. Actually, I might put it out in dollars as well because I've got the website up in front of me. So it's £5.67 for this pen. 
in dollars it is six dollars fifty one okay it's a nice pen another one to add to my uh, ever-growing collection but, uh, let's pop these uh we'll put the um multiplacers and the tips in the bag okay next thing is um, a little brush and shovel <laughs> for when you spill your drills uh this is uh, wait nope that's the wrong there we go this is called a diamond painting point drill brush desktop sweep cleaning brushes right <laughs> so you've got a little brush who knows french i did french at school but i've forgotten half of it depeche vous je vous on prie pour faire vos quelque chose. Maybe my Canadian friends can help me out with that. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, it's a little brush and shovel for um, when you spill your drills. There's blue, there's pink, and there's green. So, I'll, of course, I chose the blue one. Let's see how well it works. So, I've got my drills. And I've, this is why I said you, it would uh, work for you, Claire. <laughs> Claire. When she does a clear and spills her drills everywhere when she's kitting up. Uh, so like, oh, I've made a mess. All the drills have gone everywhere. We can just get a little brush. A little brush and shovel. There we go. Yeah, it's working really well, actually. Apart from this one this one doesn't want to get so there it goes <laughs> now it did on the website what it had is it had you know because um you're putting it back through the little handle so they, they showed a little picture of you pouring it back through the handle but to, you know you can really just pop it back into your tray i think it's probably the easiest way and then use your tray the spout on your tray to pop it back into your uh into your pot this pot's rather full so there we go what do you think about that a wee, a wee brush and shovel for when you spill your drills it's just another little gizmo it's just another little bit of tools <laughs> yay <laughs> so this cost uh two pounds fifty one I mean, you could use it for other things. You don't need to use it for cleaning up your drills. You could use it for just like, you know, generally cleaning up your desktop or, you know, for anything that you spill. You know, maybe you're having a snack and you've got some crumbs. Just sweep them all up. Um, so, yeah, £2.51 uh, for that. And in dollars, it is $2.88. I thought that was quite cool. Yeah, but I don't know what that means in uh, what that means in French at all because you know I've forgotten all my French that I learned at school. Right, so that is the brush, and last but not least, we've got this box here, and you know, judging by the size of it, uh, you're probably thinking, mm, "Is that storage?" You'd be like, you'll be right, it is storage. I don't need this scissors actually, it's coming off. And this is storage that I've been wanting to try for a while. I've seen tons of folk with this storage. And um, when the guys at New Crafty asked me if I wanted to review it, then I thought, oh yeah, because <laughs> I want that storage. And that is the large TikTok, TikTok? <laughs> Tic Tac boxes. So yeah, it's, uh, it's these large Tic Tac boxes. Now you can get tons in here. I think they're about twice the size of a regular Tic Tac box. I've got stickers, labels, always come in handy. Everything looks, everything looks um, 
intact nothing looks broken that I can see so yeah it's a nice satisfying click isn't it how easy is it to get the lid off brilliant the lids are actually quite soft and pliable so they're not that hard plastic I mean obviously the pots themselves are Let's get my trusty blue rhinestones out again. So here we've got the regular pot, you know, these round pots. I'll, I really do like these round pots. So what we'll do is, I haven't got a clue how many drills fit in one of these, um, but uh, we'll see how it compares to these round pots. Ho, 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 ho. You can get a lot more in. You can probably get probably another half a pot in there or maybe a third of a pot. So you get more in these square tic-tac containers than you are in the round pots. How easy are they to... Well, you know, yeah, they'll be a lot easier to, to use, I think, than the... Uh, you just flip it up. Perfect. Pours out into the tray fine. And... Uh, can we get them back in without taking the lid off completely? Yeah, we can. That's really cool. Excellent. Me like. Right, so these storage containers, you get in it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Eight fours are 32. So says it on the website i've counted them <laughs> uh, it says it on the website so yeah it's a 32 grid 5d diy diamond painting tools storage box embroidery beads case it costs 11 pounds and 97 pence and in dollars that is 13 dollars 73 okay so yeah they, these uh these look good Oh yeah, I'll be using these to kit something up in quite soon and try to test them out. I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to testing these out. Make sure they're all kind of, yeah. It's really robust actually. Excellent. Wow. Put these back into my. Uh, I'll take that out actually. Put these back into my uh, little round pot. Okay. So there you go. Um, yeah. What do you think of these items from uh, New Crafty? Some tools. Um, yeah, a little bit different. No diamond painting, but diamond painting related. So, we have our storage case, our tic tac containers. We have our brush set, brush and shovel set. And we have a beautiful pen with the blue and the gold sort of detailing inside resin pen. Very nice. Very nice indeed. So what I'll do is I'll link all these products down below. Um, I will also link the New Craft Day website down below as well. Please go and check them out. They've got some really good stuff on there um, as well as um, the tools. They've also got um, diamond paintings, cross stitch, you know, various crafts and bits and bots off the canvas items. Um, yeah, please go and check them out. And if you spend over $50, you can get two free gifts. Who doesn't like a free gift? And if you do decide to purchase anything from the website, please don't forget to use my discount code, um, GAMER10. It will be in the description box down below. Okay, so thank you very, very much for watching. Thank you very much. Let's move this out of the way. 
Thank you very much to uh, New Crafty for sending me these three items for review. And I'll see you all in my next video, guys. Okay? Cheerio.